find the HCF of 70 and 165. To find the HCF, first we should do the prime factorization of each number separately. That is C. 70 here and 165. Okay, next. For this number, the last digit is 0, so we take 5 here. The first number is 7. A number close to 7 in 5 table is 5 ones 5. 7 minus 5 is 2, 2 carried forward making it 20. When do we get 20 in 5 table? 5 fours 20. Now here we have 14, 14 is 2 sevens 14. Now we have 7, 7 is a prime number, so 7 ones 7. For this number, last digit is 5, so we take 5 here. The first number is 1, 1 smaller than 5, so we take 2 numbers, that is 16. A number close to 16 in 5 table is 5, 3 is 15. 16 minus 15 is 1, 1 carried forward making it 15. When do we get 15 in 5 table? 5, 3 is 15. Now, for this number, each digit is 3. And most important, 3 is a prime number. So we directly take 3 here. The first digit is 3. When do we get 3 in 3 table? 3 ones 3. We have 3 again, so you write 1 again. Here we have 11. 11 is a prime number, so we take 11 ones 11. Now our HCF is HCF is the product of numbers which, are, which should be present here and also here. I repeat, HCF is the product of numbers which should be present in these two places. Now let us find the numbers present here and also here. Starting with the number 5. Do we have 5 here? Yes. So you cut 5 right here. Next number is 2. Do we have 2 here? No. Next number is 7. Do we have 7 here? No. No more numbers are left. We have only one number 5 present in these two places. So this is our HCF. Am I clear?